everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda, Janine's new quest for Zelda Classic Part 2. Today I'm going to try and buy some upgraded equipment, and then we're going to try and find level 3 and 4. Here's hoping I can get all that done. Alrighty, let's bomb this wall up and see what we got. Buy something, Link. Well, I can only buy bait. Do I want to get that right now? Probably should. Because who knows when I'm going to need it. For all I know, level 3 might have a hungry, hungry gorilla. I need to be prepared. And I do know two other items I want to get, but man, I'm going to have to scrounge up a lot more cash. Well, since we're in the area, I could try to get another heart container. So if I remember from the first quest, there's another one right in this region. Now we get some more uh, secrets too with the candle. Whoa! Hmm. Okay, a shield shop. Damn, I kind of wish I saved my money. <laughs> That's okay. And a 750 for the mirror shield too. Yeah, I'm gonna get me a magic shield for now. Whoa, okay, so... I guess we're gonna need the red candle to burn that bush. So, can't touch that heart container for a little while. Oh well. Let's burn this bush instead. And we got a meat one magic bookshop. Okay. Well, at least I'm finding a bunch of things. Burn this. Yay, extra money. I will always takey takey. Hmm, anything over here? No. Well, I guess I can try to go right to level 3. I'm glad all the P hats are gone. That is definitely appreciated. Replaced by Octorockies. Well, there is another ruby spot I can find. Okay, well, I got 150. Let's go get that shield. Yes. And I got my eyes set on that mirror shield next. So I'm eventually going to get that. But hey, I finally got a magic shield. That's something to celebrate. Don't have to worry about statue beams as much now. I just burned this bush. Nothing. Let me try this other bush here. Maybe something will appear. No. Alright, sword upgrade, shield upgrade, now I just need an armor upgrade and I'll be all set. Alright, burn this bush maybe? Alright, it's gotta be the one below it then. Yes, more money. Keep it coming. Alright, 64 rubies. Yeah, I might do some mountainous grinding off camera after this part, so that way I can work up enough to get the mirror shield. Boy, I would love to get that early on. That would just be fan-freaking-tastic. Oh, the green levers are dropping quicker now. Uh, let me see, I'm trying to remember if there's any other stuff I wanted to get. Is there anything else big in this neighborhood? Not that I can think of off the top of my head. So I guess with that being said, we can probably go to level 3. Thought there might have been something else I wanted to grab along the way. Hell if I can think of it, though. Well, let's check out this shop. Oh, I got bow and arrows here, but I can't afford either right now. Arg. Boy, arrow's 160, hoy. That is gonna take a while to reach. But so far with these dungeons, I've noticed the uh, same bosses are in them, so like level 1 Aquamentus, level 2 Dodongo. So we know 3, we're probably gonna get a Manandela. 
So if memory serves me, we won't need the bow and arrow until probably level 6. This is the last first appearance of Goma, normally. So I could probably go without the bow and arrows till 6, prob maybe. <laughs> Here's hoping, anyway. Can't be certain because, well, Landmola showed up in friggin' level 1. So who knows what else this game's gonna do. Yes, give me more. More cash! Well, let's open up the medicine shop, as I, ha I do have the blue map on me. Yay. Oh! This is now a shield shop! Wish I knew about that sooner. I thought the medicine lady- oh wait, the medicine lady migrated up to the shop above, never mind. Yeah, she lives in this normal shop, or what used to be a normal shop. Oh god. There we go. Buy some medicine link. Sure, I'll buy a blue since it's cheaper right now. I'll potion stack later on when I get a bunch of ex excess money. When that'll happen, who knows. Okay, wasted enough time, let's go to level 3. I feel ready. Oh, damn you. Yeah, you gotta be careful on this screen. Yeah, you got the beam firing Octorakis, and that's why you want a mere, uh, magic shield for this. And the white sword so you can kill these guys quicker. It only takes like two hits to get rid of them. Wooden sword, it'll take forever. So, yeah. Level 3, here we go. And three keys to start off this dungeon, too. Yeah, we got car sort of a... It's almost like a hot hot red kind of uh, dungeon template here. There's souls in here. Yay, wrecked them and got more bombs. Always good. And we got the Dongos. Okay. They are back for more. Time to retire them permanently. Ooh ah. Alright, got a key. Do 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 do. And I'm guessing level three will be shaped like the number three. But let me see if there's anything up here. No. Alright, got a dark room, but I have a blue candle now, so not afraid of them anymore. Oh, give those. Well, glad I have the white sword. Tear through these guys quicker now. Maybe with luck we'll find the blue ring in a dungeon. That'd be something. Alright, gotta push one of these blocks. This one, I guess. And to the right we go. And we got bunnies. Oh boy. Pole's voice. Well, with the white sword, they shouldn't be a problem. I mean, buddy slaying will be a little hard, but... Thankfully, the room's not crammed full of them. Still got plenty of room to maneuver. As long as I have that, that's all I ask, really. And we get ten rubies. Not a bad prize. Alright, now we got two different variants of souls in here. Oh, we got the fire and the normal. Fun. At least the green ones I'm killing right away, which is nice. Now, fire souls are gonna take a bit more effort, but that's okay. Alright, get nothing for killing them. Let's continue. Oh, more Pulse Voice. And we got statue shooters this time. I'm gonna stay tucked in the doorway and kill them. Hopefully it'll keep jumping downwards so I get four, more free hits off. Yeah, until I get the blue ring, I'm not really gonna try and tank things, because I can't afford to. These guys do two hearts of damage. 
I mean, when it's safe and the statue beams are not really going crazy on me, I'll... There's only three bunnies in here, I feel pretty confident now. Just wanted to clear a couple out first. Yeah, I guess the bow and arrow would make this dungeon laughably easy. And we get a key for killing them, go up here, and more good those. Yeah, our blue flame ain't doing much to them, sadly. Unravel the mummy men. Okay, push the block. Bomb here. Is it, if I remember, it's shaped like a three, so there might be a bombable wall in one of these rooms. Yeah, I might want to try bombing the next couple, make sure. I don't exactly remember, you know. Oh, we got red dark nuts, okay. Oh, a little crowded on this side of the room. Oy. There we go. I can breathe now somewhat. Alright, is there anything over here? No. Oh, die you. Alright, go through the locked door here after wasting the dark nuts. Now we got a room with all fire souls. And I just roasted one. Uh, I'm gonna just wait till... I'm just gonna stay tucked in here, I'll be safe. Come on, Gels, get over here. Just trying to keep my eyes on all the statue fire here. Yay, made some nice money. Bomb over here. Nope, nothing. Better make sure I can't walk through the wall, either. No, okay. Guess we're going up, then. Ooh, get under the pulse voice. Yeah, we got Bunny, Zol... Oh, we got Zol Tribble in here with the Gibdos and the pulse voice. Okay, I'll move out of the way here. Don't want to get impaled by bunny ears. Okay, anything over here, maybe? No. We continue going up. Alright, looks like I got one blue dark nut in here with a bunch of, uh, red. Or in this case, green dark nut. Yay, stop watching. I just made all these enemies ridiculously easy. Compass! Woo. And we got an Aquamentus. Only one this time, but it has statue support. And we murdered it with the white sword. Now we bomb here. Okay, more dark nuts and one green. Hey, get over here. And green is dead. Get the map. Yay. And I guess we gotta push a block and open up that shutter. So we're just going dead straight. Okay, we got Fire Zoles, Pulse Voice, and a Blue Dark Nut. Oof. Kind of a tough room here. I'm gonna stay up against the block barricade so I can deal with the Dark Nuts better. Get out of here, fire gel. Alright. Feeling better about my chances now. Oop. Yeah, keep moving, keep moving. Alright. Is there a dungeon item in here? Aha. Uh -huh. Let me... Oh, that's a passageway, never mind. I want to go over here then. The dungeon item... Yep, it's going to be in this room. Oh boy. Kind of a tough room. Ooh. Yeah, with <laughs> corner traps, it's gonna be really nasty. And with blue dark and green dark nuts running around, uh, and the pulse voice bouncing all over, it's gonna get crazy. 
And add to the fact all these enemies could do two hearts of damage to me since I only have a green tunic. It's gonna be really bad. So I gotta kill both Dark Nuts and Pulse Voice to get him out of here and I'll feel better. Alright. It's looking a little clear. Oh, stopwatch, good. Yay, that room just got made hella easy. Alright, what's my reward for cleaning out this room? Better on passageway! Okay. Alright, looks like the other way takes me to the boss, it looks like. Fire Zol, Zol Tribble, and the regular Zol. has got a mix of every Zol variant. Yay. Alright, going straight ahead here. Oh, the boss is this way. Lovely. Well, I guess I'm going to be coming back into the dungeon. Unless I want to go get the uh, dungeon item first, which I think I want to do. Because God forbid I miss the blue ring, I'm going to feel stupid. Oh, and of course the souls come back. Yeah, it looks like I'm going to be doing four in the next part, because by the time I get out of here, it's going to be over 20 minutes. I'll try to get some more overworld exploration done, though. Still got time to do that. Alright, let's go back and see what I missed there in the other room. So I know that takes me to the boss. The boss key's probably got to be right in that room. And if I have to clear this room out again, I don't care because I can just hide in the doorway. I'm not too worried. Alright, let's see. Light this room up. Get away. You ain't getting me, boy. Okay, move middle block here, and now this should take me to the dungeon item. Really hoping it's the blue ring coming up. I'm not quite banking on that, though. Alright, I'll come back and deal with these guys. What's over here? Okay. Yeah, my dungeon item's gonna be in here almost for certain. Three poles voice, three blue dark nuts, or green dark nuts. Just gonna camp out in the doorway and kill him. The room being cramped with blocks and everything can be a little hard to deal with the dark nuts. Okay, push the third block here, I'm sure, or... I know one of these blocks are gonna budge. Which one is it? Oh, we're gonna find it. I know it's in here. Ah, oh, it's that one, okay. And the item of the dungeon is... Blue Ring, baby! I wasn't seeing it in the overworld, so I had, kinda had a feeling it was gonna be in a dungeon. Alright. Magic shield, blue ring, white sword. Chances looking a lot better to beat the man Andola now. Now I'll only take a heart of damage from the pole's voice. So I got seven hits to my name now. Murder of the bunnies! go, and push that block, now we go back. Well, we're already gonna be a third of the way through this game once I'm finished with three. Okay, now we gotta go back this way. I have a feeling the room's filled up again. Or not! Okay, good. I was coming back expecting to have to deal with all these enemies again. But thankfully, that's not the case. Okay, boss time, let's go. Glad I went back, it was definitely worth it. Okay, give Doan three blue dark nuts, or green. Green as a lima bean. Come on. 
And the boss key. Now let's get our bomb out and get ready. Whoa. Two manhandlers. Eek. Really glad I got my blue tunic. Ah, great. Alright, I'm gonna have to stay over here. Come on. Alright, I, I can kill him from up and down here, but ugh, it's gonna be really tricky. At least I can shield their beams. Alright, come on, you. Get over here. Alright, I'm not risking it. Come on. Good boy. Yay. Beat the two men and the laws. And we got our third Triforce piece, and that will do it for level 3, folks. Yeah, this game doesn't mess around at all. Alright, beam, mock the Rockies. Kill them all, kill them all! Stun. Fairy. Alright. Got rid of all of them. And now I'm gonna cut it off here, folks. Alrighty, stay tuned for Let's Play Legend of Zelda, Janine's new quest for Zelda Classic Part 3, when I will go buy some new equipment, because I'm gonna do some heavy-duty grinding off-camera, and then we'll hopefully go right to level 4. Anyway, see you then, peoples!